Hi friends, a little bit different video today. I wanted to call attention to the military. And while I'm in the United States, that's obviously gonna be the military that I support, but the military in general, I hope that all of you who have served are supported by your friends, your family, your country, and in your faith because the military is a job I could not do and a job that has hurt a lot of people. And in this great country, our military has done so much to save us, protect us, and unite us as a country in times of war and in times of peace. Please know that the sacrifice that you have given to your country and for your family is appreciated and respected. All of you who have sacrificed your time, time with your family, time with your friends, your studies, putting your life on hold for your country, it is truly appreciated. And the after effects that active service may have had on you and your family and friends Please know you are supported, you are loved, and you are cared about, and you are seen for everything that you did for this great country. Thank you. For those of you who are still serving, you are appreciated and respected, and we honor you for your service. Anyone who has served in any form or branch of the military. You are truly respected by me and my family. My father was in the Navy. His father was in the Marines. My spouse's father was in the Army. And I truly appreciate everything that all of you have done for this country. Thank you for your service and your dedication and your sacrifice. For those of you who lost someone who served, please know that you are loved and appreciated for the sacrifice that they gave. Their lives will not be forgotten and their lives were more than just the service and time that they gave. As I sit here now in this place of solitude and respect for those who have served this great country of the United States, I also would like to reiterate, this is for anyone who has served. You are appreciated and respected for your time and sacrifice. For those of you who made the ultimate sacrifice for this country or the country they lived in, your families are appreciated and respected for the sacrifice that you made. I cannot thank you enough for what you have done to protect this country, the country you live in. And being in the military is a difficult job. It, puts you in places that you're not comfortable with, it puts you in duty to make decisions that you may not morally be comfortable with, and it puts you away from your family and your friends. But most of all, military service is not just for a part of your lifetime, it is for all of your lifetime. And I want to encourage anyone who has served, who is struggling with the after effects of active service, no matter how long ago you served, to reach out to your community, whether through your veterans benefits or through a counselor or psychiatrist or therapist who specializes in someone who has served in active duty. Please know there is help out there and please know that from a faith standpoint, there is help from God and there is help in the faith community, both with counseling, therapy, and simply prayer. You are not alone, and you will always be respected and appreciated for what you have done for this great country. And please know that you are not alone. You are not alone in the nights that are hard. You are not alone in the days that are hard. And you are certainly not alone in your suffering, both mentally and or physically. Thank you for all that you have done, and know that you are appreciated and loved. At this time, I'd like to close with a prayer for anyone who has or is active in service. Heavenly Father, we ask that you protect all who are in active duty and all who have served. Whatever struggles, both physical, mental, and even spiritual, 
that they have faced because of their service. Let them find comfort, peace, love, and healing in you. Help them reach out to find the services that they need to overcome their struggles and let them heal and continue to live a life of love, peace, and happiness in your name. In this we pray in your son's holy name, Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you friends for watching and thank you all of you who have served.